This is Redbeard on this adventure, the 2020 Great American Motorcycle Show. An indicator to me that this might be a good show was a number of motorcycles in the parking lot. It wasn't a particularly sunny day, it wasn't a particularly warm day. So that told me that the people who were there were actually riders. The Great American Motorcycle Show is a mixture of more than just motorcycle related stuff. The most unrelated to me was a soft tub hot tubs. One of the first people I talked with was with Motorcycle Fellowship. His booth was set up to sell calendars to raise money for victims of domestic abuse. The Motorcycle Fellowship is a DIY motorcycle shop. You can either uh, have them do the work, or you do the work, or have them teach you to do the work. The Greater Atlanta British Motorcycle Association were there with lots of bikes. But of course, there were a lot of other bikes. Indian, Honda, lots of custom bikes. Even some with V8 engines. There was also a contest. Here is a second place winner in the unique class. It's a bike named touch of class. With all the different dealerships, insurance, law offices, leather goods, hearing protection, my favorite two things were this African twin that did what became called the Great North American Motorcycle Tour. It was 92 days, 21,000 miles. It was ridden by a guy named Hawk. My other favorite thing were the tourism groups were there. I saw two of them. The Appalachian Backroads out of Virginia and the Southern Dozen out of Johnson City, Tennessee. Appalachian Backroads has GPX files to download. You can also go to AppalachianBackroads.com and there will be a link in the description. And then the Southern Dozen has an app. Uh, they also have a link to their app on their website, southerndozen.com. Again, I'll include a link in the description. Until my next adventure, this is Redbeard. See you on the road.